Are we alive? Are we good? Hey, there I am. Hi, Sand. How you doing, buddy? It's confetti. It is confetti. It's Sand. How you been? Are you ready to play some horror games? <gasps> Yay, thank you for your pet the clown. All right, the first game on the docket tonight is The Supper. Hey, Beastie, how you been? Let me see my options really quick. Music volume. There we go. Let's get it. Hello? Ooh. The Supper. Y'all hungry? Are you all hungry? Are you ready for supper? A bite-sized game by Octavia Navarro. All oh, right, your bad day at work. I'm so sorry, hon. I hope the drawing is going well. <gasps> Grandma's asleep. Psst. Oh. I had my mic fucked up. I don't even want to think about how I sounded just then. Psst, Miss Appleton. Wake up. Grandma, wake up. I'm sorry, Miss Appleton. I know your old bones are tired. Things were so much easier before, weren't they? But there's no time to rest. Look at the time. Customers will be arriving any minute now. And we don't want to keep them waiting with empty bellies, do we? Oh my god, look! Grandma! Special sauce. Oh, pigeon a la sauce rosé. One wild pigeon covered in the special sauce. Spicy red swordfish. One blue swordfish tail. Add chili pepper covered with special sauce. Hand and tongue stew. One plump human hand. One slimy tongue. Cover in special sauce. Oh, we got to stoke those embers. Oh, we have a fire ember with a tong. I'm sure that'll go fine. Oh, we need to cut that, don't we? Solid wax. All right. What's going on in here? We need to light the candles. Oh. Okay. I bet that's what the... I know it's dark in here. Some light will make the place more inviting. There we go. Well done, Mrs. Appleton. Now we just have to wait for some starving souls to pass by. Oh. Granny, we got something spilling on the floor. Nah, no time for a walk now, Miss Appleton. I smell fresh clients coming this way. Why don't you go and make sure our special sauce is ready for them? Mmm, smells delicious. Do you hear that, Miss Appleton? Horses! Growling stomachs! Here they come. Do you think it could be them? The horse hungers. <laughs> oh, hello. Look, the chest. These are the men we've been looking for. Let's find them a place to sit quickly. So, what would the gentleman like to start with? Oh, one floppy tongue. Ooh, spicy red swordfish, a personal favorite. A mouth-watering delicacy that's healthy as well. Lots of omega-3. Oh. 
Do you hear that, Miss Appleton? Hand and tongue stew. And you thought the recipe wouldn't be appealing to our customers. I was right. You were wrong. Excellent choice. A pigeon a la sauce rosé is our chef's specialty. So that's a spicy red swordfish for the mind-controlling beast on the left. Oh, I see now. It's a, I see. A pigeon a la sauce rosé for the sick man on the right. And a fine hand and tongue stew for the dangerous looking blue shark in the middle. Of course, all served with our delicious secret sauce. Come on, Mrs. Appleton, go fetch the ingredients. And don't forget to check out the recipe list in the kitchen if you have any problem remembering them. One wild pigeon, okay. What am I gonna do with the wax? Okay, we need to cut that. Blued swordfish, a chili pepper. Okay. Nope, not that. What am I doing with solid wax? I have to go fetch the ingredients. Oh. Lever. What's up? Oh, well, Grandma's like, I don't know. What am I supposed to do with that? knew he'd lose his head sooner or later. Dang, we needed that tongue. Hmm. Boots got tongue. Do boots have tongues? Oh shit, you're right. Boots totally have tongues. Well, we could still use his hand, maybe. Hmm, that's not it. Nope. to throw the boot at the pigeon. Sorry. The main ingredient for pigeon supreme a la sauce rose. Now let's finish the dish. That is not... Oh, can I have my boot back? I cannot. Yank the ladder, Granny, like it owes you money. Well, Granny, what do you want me to do? One wild pigeon covered in special sauce. We, we didn't cook it at all. All right, now who wanted what? Oh, you wanted the pigeon. Yep. <gasps> Eat up. Bon appetit, monsieur. Oh. <gasps> you can tell by his pale face that he really enjoyed his last supper. Don't worry. They are used to pass out in taverns. They won't notice he's not, he stopped breathing. Oh, we're gonna feed people to each other, aren't we? 
right, I probably can't use the scissors for this, but I want to see. Are you kidding me, Mrs. Appleton? You'll never cut anything with those rusty scissors. Can I clean them with solid wax? Can I clean them in my special sauce? He's not hungry. I hope you're not thinking of climbing up on there. Yeah, Granny's old legs can't handle that. She'd fall and break a hip. Hey, there we go. What do we got here? Captain's cabin. Oh, hmm. I think I know this guy. Let me taste his blood. Oh, yes, indeed. Captain Clint McCurry, my sister's second husband. Looks like you won't be beating anyone up ever again, Clint. Oh, Grandma. I trust these chili peppers, but... <laughs> okay, I don't need to go back in there. Nothing over here. Can I take maybe... Nope. Looks like Swordfish is up next. We need that squirmy, wormy tongue. tongue coming right up. Wait, wait, the special sauce has to be added at the end. Follow the recipe. Oh, you're right. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, ominous voice. Woo, let's go. Well done, Mrs. Appleton. Our spicy red swordfish is ready to be served. Eat up. It's good for you. There you go. Bon appetit. <laughs> Too spicy. Ah, yes, a satisfied stomach. This delicatessen is a picture worth dying for. Hey, Licky. Bon appetit. I'll be taking that tongue and those keys. Perfect. Can I save? I can. Oh, new save. There we go. Oh, a plump human hand. Oh, I need to... Ah, yes, and then dip the hand. And now it looks all juicy. Perfect! Those are the main ingredients. Now let's finish the dish. What have you been up to, Licky? Are you hungry? Mrs. Appleton can make you something. 
Well done, Mrs. Appleton. The hand and tongue stew is ready to be served. Bon appetit, my cartilaginous friend. Cartilaginous. He's got cartilage. Oh. <gasps> Another satisfied customer. Such a tasty delicacy can't help but defeat even the most discerning of stomachs. Well done, Mrs. Appleton. Miss Appleton. The service was impeccable. I don't think our customers have any complaints, do they? Great. Now let's clean all this mess up before the stench gets the attention of the authorities. He's not... Okay, I'll go get the wagon. Uh-oh. Miss Appleton. Oh. Great idea, Miss Appleton. This will be useful to carry the bodies out. Dum de doom. Ten fathoms deep on the road to hell. Yo ho ho, and a bottle of. Oh, here you are. Oh, it's an incinerator or a garbage disposal. We never used the grinder with such large specimens. It's a grinder. Let's hope their bones don't get too stuck. Ah. Well done, Miss Appleton. You perform diligently. What was in the chest? Oh! Hello! Sis, thank you, Miss Appleton. I appreciate all you've done for me. At last, I'm allowed to rest, and so are you. I have so many good memories of you and I working side by side. Oh, You were my dearest friend. When those beasts dragged me out from our kitchen, I knew I was done for. I swear I didn't steal that gold nugget from them. I want it fair and square. While I was anguishing, suffocating inside this chest they put me in, there was only one thing I knew for certain. You wouldn't rest until you found me, dead or alive. I'm deeply sorry you had to lose your own sanity along the way. Please, find a quiet place to bury my bones, near the old well where I like to spend time. It's time for me to leave, Mrs. Appleton. Sweet dreams, my dear friend. And goodbye. Grandma was absolutely 100% vindicated. She was right to kill those three. Who cuts off a sweet old lady's legs? Awful. The supper, that was cute. That was a really cute short game. I liked that. Thank you, Octavie Navarro. 
That was nice. I liked that a lot. It was nice. Ooh, the organ goes hard. Made with Unity, Adventure Creator by Chris Burton. Freesound.org, narrator font. Hmm. Grandma? Thank you for playing! Thank you for making the game. If you enjoyed this little game, please consider supporting the developer. So we can keep creating games. You can do so by buying the PDF art book DLC. Oh, that's right. Thanks for your generosity. Yes. So that was the supper. It was free on Steam. If you are interested and you liked what you saw and you'd like to support the developer, they've got a art PDF book on Steam as well. So there you go.